So I want to reiterate something that I brought up a few days ago. Um, all that happened with the internet was that ideas that seemed crazy started to divide people. They said, oh, this source has this point of view in this way or another on social views. So their information is, is, is gobbledygook and garbage. And people are like, oh, okay, you know, and then they're like, well, you know, it's weird. I mean, the person actually had some like court cases and other things. And to, you know, they, they had this paper trail. They had the, so then the concept of receipts comes into people's parlance. There's not even, there's not even fake news yet. This is like the, the build-up 2014, 2013, that more and more this character, Alex Jones, brings up ideas that, like, no, this is really happening. Your government really, like, does stuff like this. Or, you know, or some, this is happening and nobody, your government won't tell you and won't warn you. And uh, so stuff like that that really fundamentally came down to this was this was uh, chicanery, like government, the authorities were doing something that was unjust. So after a while, this is the problem that people have on the left is that Alex Jones won a lot of things he said. People love, like, bringing up the crazier, totally crazy stuff that he might say. But then there's things that it's like, yeah, well, the beautiful part about this was this is, this part of it was in print. And it was presented as news. So the writer actually had to have the receipts. And there's a number of things on the right that it's like, the, these are the preeminent sources of information now for men 50 years and down. And people on the left, Democrats, you don't care about our sources. You don't care that we have so much going on as far as receipts. And so now it's this thing of it won't matter how much. Like, I really am kind of enjoying seeing somebody like Destiny really attempt to do this thing of like, no, for the historical record, I must debate these people and show that I had, and by the end of it, it's going to be, oh, well, according to the official record from the government itself, the government was helping something unjust. And like, so right now, there's the 113 page COVID 19 report out. And this is, this is, a, this is doom for the CDC. This is doom for the FDA. Like the whole thing is going to have to be revamped. And a lot of these firms that were involved, they're, they're open to now all sorts of lawsuits. Bill Gates is being indicted in Norway, if I remember correctly. Like the EU countries are way up on top of this. Note that suddenly Destiny doesn't want to talk about European, Western European countries that were very, very unsatisfied with the way that Big Pharma dealt with uh, COVID-19 um, disclosures, demands for data, things like that. And now it's turning out also, it's like, oh, the Biden administration in, in, open, in openly making claims that you can't uh, get infected and you can't spread it if you get the vaccine with literally it written under that statement someplace that none of that was true. So they openly deceived the American public by encourage and encouraging mandates. Like, this is a big deal. And this is, wow, Destiny, you were super duper extra double wrong and somebody like me was inherently smarter than you to not fall for it. And soon it's gonna be Jan 6th. When the official reports come out and are like, there's all this information that we just don't, we're, we, no one will give us. No legal, no law enforcement authorities will give us any of this information. So we have no idea of the guilt or innocence of a lot of these people. And then you're going to be one of those people, buddy. A lot of you are going to be those people.
that you were willing to jail up your own countrymen because the government put on an op and you got fooled because you're the kind of people who get fooled by by the, the alignment of the government, information services, security services, secret agencies, and a lone political party. And that's, that's, uh, you guys fell for that. Not the rest of us. You guys fell for it. Take care.